The drug we're doing is extremely unique. Heck, we don't even know if it has the proper characteristics to even classify it as a drug. Other drugs usually have a visual appearance and physical form. However, our drug is different from that. And it's called idosing. Before we tell you what idosing is, I'll show you how it looks like. And here it is. I know what you're thinking. Clint, you showed us nothing. And I meant to do that because I do say uses sound to make the user hot. When you're eye dosing, you're supposed to lay down anywhere, put on a blindfold just so you don't focus on anything else. Lastly, headphones must be put on. Once the headphones are in, each earbud emits a sound of different frequency. Each side of the brain would work differently, but over the time, the brain is supposed to get used to it, which then turns those two frequencies to a new one, which will put the user in various states. There are various soundtracks which are used. Majority of these are named after real drugs as they mimic the effect of this specific drug. Some of these tracks are cocaine, weed, codeine, LSD, and Gates of Hades, which is said to be one of the most intense idols track. I'd like to take some time explaining what my friends Jasmine and Sarah experienced while doing some idosing of their own. So our class went to the computer lab, and Sarah and Jasmine shared the same computers. While doing very important work and research, they saw me reading an article about idosing. They were curious enough and were interested in the fact of getting high off of sound, so they decided to try it themselves. Jasmine went first. Her idol session went for around 12 to 15 minutes, and after those minutes, she said that she felt like her heart was pounding, her temples felt weird, and according to Sarah, her legs were shaking. For Sarah's effects, she said that her brain felt really foggy, she said that she felt like as if she was floating, and it kind of felt like an out-of-body experience. The effects might be different for different people. Some effects might be greater than others, some not as strong. So if you want to try idosing for yourself, YouTube has a variety of idos tracks. Oh, and by the way, since they're all based off of sound, I'm pretty sure idosing is 100% legal.